we're going to be doing some sequential finger touching, which means we're just going to be touching each finger to our thumb in order. And we're going to try to be touching with the very tips of our fingers, so we don't want them flat like this, no teardrops, no raindrops, nice round circles, just like this. If you want and you don't mind having some marker on your hands, you can always have an adult help with put just like a tiny little dot on the very tip so that we can see right where we want to touch. To start with, we'll do our pointing finger to our thumb. We'll do one, two, three, four, five. Next, one, two, three, four, five. And our ring finger, one, two, three, four, five. Last is our pinky, one, two, three, four, five. Next, we'll do our other hand. You can shake out your hand to get it ready. We'll do pointing finger to thumb, one, two, three, four, five, and then to our next finger, one, two, three, four, five, to our ring finger, one, two, three, four, five, the last finger by itself, one, two, three, four, five. Now we can do both hands together. We're gonna to do pointing fingers to thumb. One, two, three, four, five. To our middle, one, two, three, four, five. Ring fingers, one, two, three, four, five, and our pinkies. One, two, three, four, five. We'll shake out our hands and we did it. We did our sequential finger touches. You can do these every day to keep practicing and strengthening those pathways in our brain that'll make this easier and easier over time. Have fun.